Can you make an antimatter bomb? Given by the famous E equals MC squared, even a kilogram of antimatter is 3,000 times stronger than the Hiroshima nuke. Doesn't that mean that a large antimatter warhead could wipe out life as we know it? It could, but it's almost impossible to produce that much. We create antimatter through particle collisions, which release energy that gets converted to particles and antiparticles. Since their charges are flipped, we can collect the antimatter with magnets. We've only produced 10 nanograms of it, about enough for a AA battery. Why is it difficult? We're limited by the energy of the collisions. The bigger the particles we collide, the more energy we need. Costs enter trillions of dollars per gram, too unfeasible. For something that's just regular matter with flipped charges, it's pretty hard to obtain. Processes like cosmic ray bursts or beta decay may one day give us the particles we need, though. So, we can't make antimatter bombs just yet. Who knows where things could go, though?